Welcome to Tooth and Claw TV. On this episode, we're gonna be wrapping up our Wyoming trip. This is actually gonna be the last morning and our very last stand. Let's go ahead and jump right into the action. All right, we're fixing to make our, probably our last stand of my Wyoming trip. We got a beautiful bottom to call here. We made about three stands and ain't had much luck. We did see a box earlier, but it didn't work out. We'll set our call out down here about 30, 40 steps. Let's see what happens. two more coyotes up and we got a pretty stiff wind coming. We were actually set up calling this bottom, had a good crosswind. These coyotes come straight up wind, come plumb. I don't know how far they responded from. I mean, it's a long ways up there. But anyway, this coyote was on a mission to circle down with this call. <clears throat> Shut the call off and whooped at him a couple times down there. Still wouldn't stop, switched to a pup stress and he finally stopped down there for us. Probably a, I don't know how far is that feel. 135. 135. It didn't make it much farther than 100. Look, coyote down, baby. All right. Well, I'd say this coyote right here is going to calf off a pretty amazing wheat. When our grand's a pretty coyote, too. Here we call here. Old lightning jack strikes again. Got quite a bit of wind down in here, and I figured that'd be a good sound to use. Get some a little bit louder. It's a louder sound. All right, right here's a coyote. I mean, he's a beauty. Looks like. Hi, I'm Brian Clark with Kentucky Department of Fish and Wildlife, and we want to encourage you to check out our online maps. We have tremendous interactive resources there at fw.ky.gov. Just click on the maps link and uh, check it out. You can go to uh, specific areas. You can search by geography if you're in a particular area for any kind of hunting you want to do in Kentucky. Again, that's fw.ky.gov. I'd say it is the male out of the bunch. And I'm wrong, it's the female. Oh. She's a beauty too, ain't she? Beautiful cow. Well, we finished our Wyoming trip off with the bang. This is our last day to hunt. This is gonna be our last stand, and we end up calling up a double. And we started our stand out with adult cottontail distress. It's worked really good for us this week. We've killed a lot of, a lot of coyotes off that sound. 
Uh, we, that's what we started out with. We played it for about three or four minutes and the wind picked up on us a little bit, so we decided to switch over to lightning jack. It seemed like lightning jack carries a little bit better and it's a proven sound. It's killed more coyotes than anything probably. But anyway, we had these coyotes res respond, come up over the hill probably after three minutes of playing that. Come down here, circle plumb down here in front of us. It's trying to circle down wind and catch her wind, but uh, we switched over to pup distress and got this beautiful female to stop down here for about a 135 yard shot or so. And man, this has just been an awesome week of hunting. Tell you what, that's an awesome way to finish out our Wyoming trip. Call in those two coyotes and have that one come down there and give us just a perfect broadside shot down there. Couldn't ask for anything more. I sure had a blast out there spending time with my brother. Got to watch Phil shoot his very first badger. I tell you what, we killed a whole truckload of coyotes. Thanks for joining us on Tooth and Claw TV.